Hey, what's up? So next thing we're gonna do is um just run it, make sure it's working. Um, if you just click the up arrow on your terminal, you can see the. Actually, let me save this first. Um, yeah. So let's just run it again. Um, let's test exit. Well, that didn't work. Um, so it says if choice equals one, then break. Oh, it has to be in quotes because we're passing a string. Make sure both of those are in quotes. Save it and um, say one again. Actually, press Control C to end the program. And now let's run it again. And now press one. There we go. It ended the program. So, um, next thing we want to do, uh, we want to see the JSON data from these search results. So let's grab our comment here. And let's put search results in this first field. Save it. Run it. Press zero. Uh, Kendrick. And as you can see, we have only have one item here. Um, the thing is, though, uh, we need to get down to the artist's level, and then we need to get down to the items level. And items is an array, so we, it has to be at the zeroth index, because we only have one. So let me just show you guys here. So we're going to go and say our artist equals search results. artists items and then at the zeroth index and first we're going to print their name as you can see over here name is on the same level as artists items zero so we're just going to say artist name and then we're going to print out the number of followers they have so we need to type that cast this to a string and this is followers and then it's one level underneath that so total and we need to say plus And then we're going to print the genre. So we'll just say print artist. Um, let's look over here. So it says genres and it gives an array. We have to, I think the first one's good, so we'll just say genres zero. Um, and then let's make some space. And now we want to open their album artwork inside of our web browser. So let's say web browser dot open. And you guys might need to go into terminal and say pip3 install web browser. Well, sudo pip3 install web browser if it doesn't recognize this module. Um, so let's just keep going here. Web browser dot open artist images zero URL so as you can see over here there's an array of images so we're just going to grab the first one because it's the largest and then we're going to grab the URL and this is going to just open it right up in our whatever your default browser is mine is Google Chrome um, So these were the artist details up here. Next we need to go 
and get the album details for this artist. So let's first let's set three variables up here. It's going to be the track URIs, the track art. These are going to be lists, and just an incrementer z equals zero. Now we need to extract some album data. So we're going to say album results equals Spotify object dot artist albums artist ID. So this is gonna be the well we forgot to grab it up here. We need to say artist ID equals artist because you can see they have their ID somewhere up here and yeah right there so now we have their artist ID and let's go to the API and check it out so you can see artist album takes a parameter artist ID um, and a lot of these most of the stuff with the Spotify API uses IDs so artists have IDs, albums have IDs, um, and tracks have IDs. Um, and usually all of these JSON data, you'll usually get an ID with it. And you'll usually want to save that in one of your variables. Um, so next thing we're going to do in the next video is print out these album results in uh, JSON. So we're going to save this, and I'll see you in the next video.